New tonight, classes canceled tomorrow for Knox County School students. Parents found out through an email sent about five hours ago. The district said it's taking the time tomorrow to work with staff on making sure everyone is ready to return masked on Tuesday. Many parents and guardians are wondering why the district made the decision so late. 10 News reporter Caitlin Keenahan is in studio with us. And Caitlin, many of those parents are now struggling to find child care. Katie, that's right. There's a lot of confusion with parents, so we reached out to KCS asking why the decision was made so late and we haven't heard back yet, but there's even more confusion among students who say they just really want the chaos to end. The news came as a shock for some. I don't think anyone was expecting them to close school on either side. Ethan Lindsay is a student at LNN STEM Academy. He understands the situation, but doesn't understand why his education is being put on hold. And I'm just not sure what the point of canceling school is, because it seems like a pretty simple concept that the judge is telling us to enforce the mask policy. And we already did it last year, so I don't see a problem with doing it again. Others weren't so surprised. It was not a surprise to me that they were going that they were unprepared to uh, implement that quickly and nimbly. Amanda Collins is a mother to three kids in Knox County Schools. She's been advocating for mask policy all year long. So this is not even necessarily having to create something from scratch. It is literally putting into place what we did last year and what worked. Some parents are happy to hear about the district-wide mask mandate, whereas others are frustrated. Lindsay says it's the same for students. There are a lot of students who don't want to wear a mask and students who think everyone should be wearing a mask. But Lindsay says most students aren't as passionate about the debate as the parents are. I think the students are a little more of a sound mind, so it's interesting to see how all the adults are acting uh, with the whole thing. All of this comes after Knox County bus drivers threatened to stop their routes because of the mask mandate. Students will be back in class on Tuesday. Katie. Caitlin, thank you.